Hello everyone, welcome to an episode of Art Style. My name is Yuval, I'm an artist and I like to draw stuff. And today episode we're gonna take one character and draw it in 10 different styles. Okay, so our character will be Mr. Bean, the one and only. And I pick a couple of artists, 10 artists that are really turned influence that I really like and draw it in their style with my interpretation. So that's basically it. Let's start. Me and you, 10 style, Mr. Bean, let's go. Style one, my style. So this is the basic style, the basic Mr. Bean that I worked and do. Um, this, is, this is my style, you, you can see it. Uh, you got a very strong line and got very little bit of shape going there. And uh, that's the basic uh, Mr. Bean that I can work with that. Um, that's it. Style two, surreal art. So I decided to go with a surreal feeling and this is a very wide term and I just uh, did whatever I felt right to me. I gave it a little bit more crazy Mr. Bean and added some like characteristic that is very weird and something and I did my best but maybe it didn't give the real surreal feeling but it was some start of it. Style free, psychedelic art. So I decided to go with a psychedelic feeling over here. It's not real psychedelic art because you see there's a lot of point, it's just normal and psychedelic art is almost always so highly and contrast and so many color. So here's like half and half because you can see the normal Mr. Bean and the psychedelic is going from him. So it's not exactly psychedelic art, but it's got some theme of it. And I think it worked really, very nice. Style four, Picasso-like. So this is the fort and this is the Picasso-like uh, drawing that it had and more of his later period and uh, you can see all the influence of it and the, and the colors and it's very flat. The eyes were, you know, the iconic, that's the iconic feel of uh, Picasso. And I think it worked very, very nice. I like to do it. Style 5, Egon Chile. Okay, Gon is one of my favorite artists, uh, he was expressing it from Germany and he got a great line, weight, uh, great brush stroke and uh, he, he's so expressive and his art is so unique and I really really love him for a lot of time. So I try my best to copy his stroke with digital but I think he's maybe an analog uh, format it will work better but Chile is awesome. Style 6, Joe Mad. So Joe Mad is one of my favorite pencil artists. He's such a good penciler. I can always look in his art and see so many details and so many pressure line and just feel great about his art. Uh, I try my best to copy his style, but uh, I'm not as skilled as he, but I think I did pretty good. Not quite as the character like, but more of the technique like. So the line, every weight, I try to do it my best. Style 7, Corey Loftus. So, Corey Loftus is one awesome artist. I absolutely love his work. Uh, he got great shapes and great color, and his lines are magnificent. Uh, I really love him. I try, to, I try my best to copy his art, but you know, he's got a, such a unique uh, language and his expression are endless, and it's worked very well. I try my best with the colors and everything. I think it did pretty nice. Style 8, Chuck Jones. So Chuck Jones is one of the legend animators. He worked on the Looney Tunes and Tom and Jerry and a lot of cool stuff. His character expression are very, very unique in the animation style. He can deliver so much with his character. I try my best to do something with the same character uh, expression as he. And I think it's uh, okay. Maybe Elmer Fadi enough. Style nine. T Way. T Way is an awesome artist. I, he got amazing isometric artist, and his line work are unbelievable. He can have so much feeling, and so much. I don't know something about him work so well. I try my best to do his isometric work with a little more uh, surreal feeling about him. I think uh, that's turned out pretty nice. Uh, Tiwa is great. Style 10, Jean-Baptiste Monge. Okay, Jean-Baptiste is a new artist that I 
recently uh, discovered and I really like his art. He got a great fantasy art and he uses the color and the line so good. Great feeling and I try my best to also have this grayish uh, color work with him and um, yeah, I tried my best. Okay. So that's it, all the style ready to go, 9 style, 10 with my style, that will be it. I learned a lot, it was a great experience, I hope you learned something too, I hope you had fun and you enriched yourself in some way. Uh, thank you guys, you've been awesome, if you like and subscribe, that will be awesome. And that's it, have a good day, have a fine life, have a awesome day, bye bye.